Hey guys, so today's video is all about achieving that glowy, healthy looking skin and me showing you guys some tips and tricks about how I've cleared my acne. Uh, the first step is this Korean mask that my mother gave me. I will try to find a link for it, but this stuff is amazing. It just fills my skin with so much moisture and I have very, very sensitive skin. So whenever I put this on, it doesn't break me out, it doesn't burn, it doesn't do anything to my skin that... Um, a lot of other products would do um, but I just put a large amount of this product on my face and I rub it in until it kind of looks like I just stuck a whole bunch of oil on my face um, and it doesn't look the best I know but it feels amazing and I use this skin about I'm sorry I use this mask about once a week probably um, just to exfoliate my skin because what this mask does and what I love about it is that you put this on and the box says to leave it on for like 10 minutes but my mom has been using this for years so she told me to leave it on for about 30 minutes so that's what I do and I just you know go about my day and let it kind of sink into my skin and what happens is this mask starts to get kind of runny almost as it heats up into your skin so whenever this happens and after I'm done I will go after I'm done waiting I will go in and as you can see here I'll start rubbing my face in circular motions and what starts to happen is my skin starts to exfoliate and these it's going to be nasty but these beads I guess you would call them of skin start to come off of my face and it's the most gentle exfoliation that I've used on my skin and I love it which I think it's definitely helped me with my acne and my scarring and then we are going on to my favorite uh, face mask by Rada Beauty and it is the uh, dark mud clay mask I forgot what it was the Dead Sea mud mask that's what it is but my sister had given me this and I absolutely love it I will actually use this about twice a week I used to do it once a week but I found that once I started using it twice that it really just helped keep my skin clear and right now I just kind of have some uh, redness and some scarring from where my skin had been clearing up after my period and so I just, you know, I put this mask on and it just draws out all the impurities without making me break out whatsoever. It takes out all those blackheads and it helps tremendously with my acne scarring and I just love this. And the best part about it is that you don't even have to leave this mask on for that long. I believe I let, usually leave this uh, mask on for about seven minutes and it's wonderful. I love it. It's not a harsh smell to it whatsoever and it just feels so silky smooth on the skin it just it's a great texture and I absolutely love it and I've definitely noticed that after I use this there is a nice glow to my skin um, sometimes this can be definitely uh, dehydrating to my skin so I will definitely as you will see in this video I might uh, do a sheet mask which helps regain the moisture in my face which I love or I'll just kind of use extra oils and good uh, moisturizers to kind of put back the moisture in my skin that this mask might have stripped out of it. So after seven minutes, I wash it off and my skin feels so smooth and just supple. And now I'm going in with a pomegranate sheet mask, which I picked this one because it is full of antioxidants. And how antioxidants work for the skin is that they reduce oxidative stress by neutralizing free radicals. Um, so what this means is that when you have unstable atoms with unpaired electrons in our skin, the antioxidants in this mask kind of act like a way to bind unstable electrons and stop those from attacking collagen strands and this will keep our skin from aging at a very uh, 
quick rate. So uh, consuming things with antioxidants in them like pomegranates or any berries or green tea. I love green tea and things like that. It's not just about putting the products on top of your skin. It's about ingesting them as well. Um, and sometimes what I like to do is I will take some pomegranate juice and in the morning I will mix it with my water uh, just to kind of get that just to get my water intake going as well as to give me uh, some antioxidants just to start my day and then I'll probably have a cup of green tea not too long after to give me my caffeine. And of course these masks are scary to me, you look like an axe murderer, but I leave this on for about 20 minutes and when you take this off, oh it's, it's as you can see my face, it's a great feeling just to relieve your skin. And whatever moisture is left over, I just tap into my skin. It kind of looks like I might be a little forceful with these taps, but they're not. It's just really quick patting motions just to make sure my skin absorbs all the extra um, solution that is from this mask. And then I go in with vitamin C serum. And this stuff is great. I highly recommend it in your daily skin regimen as it helps with dark spots and just overall brightening your skin. It's amazing. And then, guys, I cannot tell you enough to use sunscreen. It is so important to protect your skin from the sun and the UV rays. And this will help uh, your skin from wrinkling prematurely and to really ensure that you aren't going to get any dark spots. So I put this all over my skin, I tap it in, and I always make sure to bring it down my neck and put it on the backs of my hands to help uh, with those fine lines that will come later on as well. And next I'm using, I think it's my Clinique Deep Puff Eyes. I will leak everything I used in the description box below, but I just put that under my eyes. And then I'm mixing my Rada Beauty Anti-Acne Lotion with my Rada Beauty Rosehip Oil. Mix those together and gently tap it into my skin. And then finally I spritz my skin with my Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray. And I love this so much. It gives me just such a nice glow. Oh, it just it gives me life. And that is it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time. Bye.